Devarim, Deuteronomy 20. When you go out to battle against your enemies and see horses and chariots and a people more than you, be not afraid of them. For Yahuwah, Eloheka, is with you, which brought you up out of the land of Mitzrayim. And it shall be, when ye are come nigh unto the battle, that the priest shall approach and speak unto the people, and shall say unto them, Hear, O Yasharael, ye approach this day unto battle against your enemies. Let not your hearts faint, fear not, do not tremble, neither be ye terrified because of them. For Yahuwah, Eloheikem, is he that goes with you to fight for you against your enemies to save you. And the officers shall speak unto the people, saying, What man is there that has built a new house and has not dedicated it? Let him go and return to his house, lest he die in the battle and another man dedicate it. And what man is he that has planted a vineyard and has not eaten of it? Let him also go and return unto his house, lest he die in the battle and another man eat of it. And what man is there that has betrothed a woman and has not taken her? Let him go and return unto his house, lest he die in the battle and another man take her. And the officers shall speak further unto the people, and they shall say, What man is there that is fearful and faint-hearted? Let him go and return unto his house, lest at his brethren's heart faint as well as his heart. And it shall be, when the officers have made an end of speaking unto the people, that they shall make captains of the armies to lead the people. When you come nigh unto a city to fight against it, then proclaim peace unto it. And it shall be, if it make you answer of peace and open unto you, then it shall be that all the people that is found therein shall be tributaries unto you, and they shall serve you. And if it will make no peace with you, but will make war against you, then you shall besiege it. And when Yahuwah Eloheka has delivered it into your hands, you shall smite at every male thereof with the edge of the sword. But the women and the little ones and the cattle and all that is in the city, even all the spoil thereof, shall you take unto yourself and you shall eat at the spoil of your enemies, which Yahuwah Eloheka has given you. Thus shall you do unto all the cities which are very far off from you, which are not of the cities of these nations, but of the cities of these people, which Yahuwah Eloheka gives you for an inheritance. You shall save alive nothing that breathes. But you shall utterly destroy them, namely the Chittim and the Yemarim and the Canaanim and the Perazim, the Chivrim and the Yavusim, as Yahuwah Eloheka has commanded you, that they teach you not to do after all their abominations, which they have done unto their Elohim. So should ye sin against Yahuwah. Elohekem. When you shall besiege a city a long time in making war against it to take it, you shall not destroy at the trees thereof by forcing an axe against them. For you may eat of them, and you shall not cut them down. For the tree of the field is man's life, to employ them in the siege. Only the trees which you know that they be not trees for meat you shall destroy and cut them down, and you shall build bulwarks against the, the city that makes war with you until it be subdued.